Alrighty, let's get into the pain. Let's get into the major pain. All right, I had this game on. I watched the first half, and then by the third quarter, it put me to sleep. Lakers suck. I don't even know what to say. Ten assists from Devin Booker is outrageous. <laughs> we have two games. We have two days left. <laughs> we, have, we have two games. We have two days left. <laughs> Until the end of my season ticket giveaway. Not even two days left. Less than 48 hours. As soon as Thanksgiving's over tomorrow, it's done. So now is the best time to use that promo code Clark. I was able to smack yesterday. My team did a better job at picking the plays than me, but don't worry about that. This is what I'm going with for the night, but don't worry about that. Just go play the promo code Clark because it's less than 48 hours. We're giving away season tickets. You understand? Um, the Suns had five days off. Do I need to pull up the schedule? No, I will pull up the schedule right now. Y'all don't believe me. Look at this. They played their last game November 20th. The Suns quite literally had six days off. They had six days off. The Lakers played a Thunder tonight. Somebody explain to me how any of this is fair. It's fine. Let's hop into the highlights. Charlie Ford and Shereen Mitchell from our college basketball star. I've been an SD game. I've been an SD game. I don't know where that's from, but I got it stuck in my head. I've been an SD game. <laughs> come down and double on Two to five, Davis. The Suns are so bad, too. Like. The fact that we lost to the Suns is ridiculous. Everybody was on Twitter blaming Rui. I don't even want to blame Rui. We just need a new team. We need a new team. Until we get a new team, none of this matters. None of it matters. We need a new squad, bro. We need a totally new squad. You know that this is Devin Booker's second lowest scoring points per game season of his career, and the niggas still beat us. <laughs> Devin Booker's quite literally falling off in front of our eyes, and he's still able to beat us. Vando has been injured for two years. Vandal could have got surgery at the beginning of the summer. He waited until two days before the season to get surgery. I don't know if that's fact. I read it on Twitter. <laughs> like, bro, we got to get a new team. Get Vando. Hey, like, I don't even want to go through the names. We've been through the names. We, we've been through it. We've been through it. It's not we've been through it. We've been through it. We've been through it. Let's talk about something not related to the Lakers. Dr. J recently said that he doesn't think that Kobe should get a jersey raised in every single stadium. Not even the number 24 um, not being able to get used. Just a jersey. Just put Kobe jersey up in every stadium. He doesn't think that Kobe deserves that. Dr. J. Dr. J. Julius Irving. Brother, you can't even shoot. <laughs> Until you learn how to shoot, you don't get to decide. You don't get to have an opinion on anything involving shooters. Okay, buddy? I can't even call you unk, boy, you old ass. If they want to put the Kobe up in every arena, they're going to put the Kobe up. Because you know what Kobe did that you never did other than win championships? 
He actually had a J, Dr. J. Your name is Dr. J with no J, boy. Don't make me get on your... Come on, boy. <laughs> you lucky this is 2024. Because <laughs> if this was 2017, 2018, I'd go a lot harder. I got some more thoughts. I just can't say them. <laughs> you lucky, boy. It's your old ass, boy. What the hell is wrong with this old ass man? He better chill it out. He better cool it down. He better pipe down, boy, old lad. Pipe it down. All right, I'm done with this quarter. Get me into the second one, please. How about that? Finding connect in Hollywood. Here's Kevin Durant. Who even is that, man? Who's even out there, man? Three steals by Trey Jones? Wow. Ryan Dunn, Nick Dahl, two gems found in the draft. In the corner, Hilo is so ball dominant, I hate it. I hate it. He like Julius Randle is so annoyed and they always need the ball in his hand to do anything. That's one of the best things about Steph Curry. I hate that I become a Steph Curry fan over these. <laughs> but anyways, that's one of the best things about Steph Curry. Steph Curry don't need a ball in his hand. I hate how much D'Lo need the ball in his hand to score. It's like, bro. It's just a bunch of dribbling. The Lakers just be standing around watching him dribble. Nothing's happening. Like, brother, what are you doing? God damn. Seven seconds to shoot. Final minutes of the first half. Davis was bumped to go. Great pass, Brian. Four on two. Beal finishing off. And Hachimura down court. It's Davis on that baseline with a hammer. And the Suns sounds eight of 21 in this first half of three. LeBron accelerates. You saw that opening. It doesn't take from Beal and Durant with 14. Booker with eight. Inside Nurkic. Almost lost it, retrieves, feeds, third triple, no. Oh, the pickle shoots in to put it in. I'm absolutely falling in love with this rookie right now. Big Reeves, twirling, firing, got it! Got it, what a shot by Reeves. So here come the Lakers starting the second half. Davis on top, Reeves a screen, LeBron's got it, Reeves a three over Booker. Yeah, these highlights make the Lakers look better than they are. Sleeping into the paints and finds the two. These highlights make the Lakers look way better than they are. Double figures now for LeBron with 11. The Lakers are not as good as these highlights make them look, man. I swear I've watched them miss 10 shots in a row. <laughs> I swear, they missed like 10 buckets in a row. I swear D'Lo just be holding the ball on half these possessions. They ain't gonna show that in here, but I swear he just be holding the ball. Say we were playing Chicago, then when we got down to the arena, I was focus in on, or try to focus in on this. Oh, he's looking now. Bucker, little fadeaway right there, 17. Be a deep check here for Booker. Down goes Reed to the shot by Booker. Devin Booker got hot offensively, and that just kind of opened up the floodgate. 
So this is the Lakers' first loss ever in a tournament game. And on top to Booker, who got this third quarter started the right way. Beal, the quickly trapped him. There's the defense at the perimeter. And it's a shot inside. Has a lot of consternation. Here comes the drive by Beal. Ends up. Tyus Jones! And the counter. And Hayes, the Lakers five. Here's Beal. The big Amaro setting a screen. And a three by Bradley Beal. Lakers. It's it's an interesting it's a it's a weird dynamic that's going on in LA because there's so many players that I feel like are hooping from the perspective of I'm not gonna be on this team much longer. Like D'Lo has to know this is his last year because he opted in. We're not giving him another deal. Gabe Vincent, you know, Vando, like so many of these guys, they seem like they just don't care because they know it's their last year. And it's just messing up the dynamic of the Lakers. I really don't have anything to say. I mean, I've said everything that I needed to say. Like, until we make a trade, it's going to be impossible for me to buy into this Laker team because I just understand how basketball and matchups work, and we just don't have a center. So, or a lockdown defender, or a point guard. <laughs> um, so, yeah, if you could use my promo code, that would be awesome. We get to play the Thunder on a back-to-back -to -back tonight. I'm sure they're probably going to smash us. So I'll be back tomorrow on Thanksgiving with a Lakers getting smashed by the Thunder video. Can't wait for that. Unless AD or LeBron just happens to this one of the games where they just magically goes off. We stand no ch chance. Anyways, till next time, it's been your boy. Go join, go join the gang on Patreon. I can't even talk. I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. <laughs>